Sujata Mahapatra. I'll be talking about Odissi. Odissi is one of the classical dance form from the eastern part of India. Orissa is well known for the temples. It's a temple city. The temples are totally well known for the sculpturic poses which is carved in the walls. Odissi dance is totally a devo devotion a classical dance form where you get bhakti bhava. Orissa, the name of Orissa is the origin of Odissi. Odissi was previously danced in the temples. The group of women used to dance in the temple, they are called Mahari. Mahari means Mahan Nari. The women, they considered as the servant of God. They used to perform in the temple walls in front of our deity, Lord Jagannath. Then the another group of dancers is called Gotipur. They used to dance in front of the king's court and the outside to make the entertainment for the public. Goti poor. Goti is single, poor is boy. The single boy, they used to dress as a woman and they used to perform in front of the public. Odissi is the revived form of Goti poor and Mahari. Padma Bibhushan Guru Kelchar Mahapatra, whose contribution for this Odissi is like a father architect of this dance form. Ripataka, <laughs> Open the feet. We can Ta, ah, 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 ta, ah, ti, 
I speak about Odissi, if I speak about my Guruji, I always feel that the dance always connect me to a divine power and to make me very close to my Guru. And I feel I'm very much blessed. And Guruji for me is always as a God. His work, his perfection of his work, his patience, his lifestyle made me really a good lesson how to be an artist. And as a human being, he was really, really very, very good human being. I mean, there are many things to learn from him. And by watching him, by staying with him, I have learned many things, which is now helping me a lot. I always feel that Guruji is always with me and he always helps me to flourish in my dance. And not only dance, but also how to lead as a human being in the society and how to carry the legacy of his art. Because his vision as a dancer, as a dancer, was very, very graceful, powerful, and aesthetic. And all the beauty was in the dance. And being a student and, and as a daughter-in-law of him, I always feel very proud and feel very happy that God also blessed me to be with him for a long time. Not only to guide in my life, but also in every respect. And as long as dance is concerned, our Odyssey dance is always connected to the divine power. And we are the devotees and we always think that our dance is a service to Lord God. I wish that all of the art lovers will have a real opportunity to appreciate my Guru's work, which is really a purest form. And all this behind work is done by him. I'm very grateful to have a Guru like him, who is a mentor, who is not only a Guru, but also considered as equal to God. I love him very much and I miss him too.